Good morning guys and welcome back. Today is October the 3rd. It's actually my mum's birthday today but I'm headed to London. I'm not going to see her because we that's why we had all of the celebrations at the weekend because um, it's my mum's birthday today but we did stuff on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So I'm heading to London today. It's currently 7.40. I've got five minutes before I have to leave so I thought I would show you my outfit. It's officially autumn guys. It is freezing cold outside and I said to Mike this morning I was like we have to put the heating on because it's getting so cold um, I have on my top chop leather jacket um, a white shirt which is from mango and then I have on this jumper which was in my haul video that I put this weekend which has the tie sides um, and then I have on my new model jeans from Stradivarius which were also in my haul this weekend and then I have on my new look biker boots which are my faves so yeah I feel like you can't really see my outfit because my arm is not long enough. That's what it looks like. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to London today for, um, I have a monthly kind of like creative meeting with my management team and stuff. So I'm going down to have that today. It's gonna be in the flat. So yeah, I probably won't see much of you guys today because I'll be in a meeting from 10 till six. So I'll show you my lunch and then I've got some exciting stuff happening this evening. So. Come with me to London. So I just got out of my meeting, it went really well, and I my taxi's actually now here. It's such a beautiful day in London, check this out. I'm so excited though, I have, hi. <laughs> I have so much cool content coming up for you guys in December. I have my geeky headphones on as well. Hello. Hello. Beautiful flair, right? Awesome, thank you. Um, yeah, no, so we have like the whole content calendar sorted for, um, October but then we've also been looking at Christmas stuff and I'm so excited you guys know I love Christmas content so um, we've been looking at some really cool new ideas for Christmas as well so I'm really excited for you guys to see that I'm now on my way to the station to go back home I feel like a yo-yo the next couple of days are gonna be a bit here there and everywhere but I'm going back to the station because my friend Lissy, who you guys know, is coming to stay tonight, which I'm really excited about because she lives up north and we don't get to see her that often. So she's coming to stay just for tonight and then she has like a work thing down near where we live. So she's coming for dinner, gonna make some dinner and hang out with her. Hey guys, hey guys. Hi, 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 have you got a lot to say tonight? A lot of licking to do, hey Squidgy. Hey, hey. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. How rude. Hey, Tricky Trues. How you doing, my love? Did you have a good day? <laughs> I miss you guys. Zooming in on myself. I'm not entirely sure why. So I just got home. I'm the first one home. So I'm going to get dinner on the go. I've actually been really lazy and I stopped at M&S at the station. It's eight o'clock now so I didn't really want to cook anything major so I got these like ready prepared chicken lemon and parmesan fillets there's actually four of them but Mike's on his own tomorrow night so I'm gonna separate one out for him and then I got some mushrooms some asparagus and some if I can get them out traditional stringless runner beans pre-sliced very lazy but I'm hoping that we have some sweet potatoes here because they didn't actually have any in the little m &S in the station, so that is what I'm cooking. So, I have prepared a fine meal for a Monday <laughs> evening, I think you'll agree. That is pretty good, I think, for a last minute M&S run. Look who's back. Yo, yo, yo. Back again, yeah. on circuits. Did you have a good workout? I did, but my elbow still hurts. Oh, um, the gorgeous. only person in the world that can injure his elbow whilst running. I did. <laughs> And uh, Lissy is here pouring yeah, herself yeah. some sparkly water. Like Treacle is under the table trying to steal food Treacle. again, you cheeky monkey. Behave yourself. And now I'm going to eat this because I am well hungry. Well, such good English. Excuse me, Squidge. I stand up for two minutes and you've taken my seat, you cheeky little minx. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. No chance. Move. <laughs> You're so cute. Is that right with you, Squidge, if I sit here? Hmm? Hmm? It's your spot. We're now watching a documentary on Jimmy Savile. As you do on a Monday night. Casual. Hmm. How are you doing? It is a bit creepy. It's a bit of a creepy dude. Oh, talking of creepy. What is this cat doing? The cat there. Piglet has been grumbling all evening. She's literally sitting there and she keeps going 
Oh. Mm, are you grumpy? So, go put go the camera away. elsewhere. So cute. I'm just getting into bed and Mike changed the sheets today when I was gone. There is nothing better than fresh sheets. My favourite feeling in the whole world. Yes. Good morning guys. So today is going to be another two day vlog because Hello. yesterday, <laughs> Mike in his dressing gown, yesterday was a little short and today it's going to be um, pretty similar because I am heading back down to London for more meetings today. But I've got some exciting stuff this evening again. My sister is coming down so I should be seeing her. And I'll explain a bit more anyway because I've got to leave. I just wanted Mike to do a really quick outfit of the day. Interrupt your washing up of the pan from last night. Did you enjoy your meal? It was delicious, wasn't it? Yeah, it was acceptable, I <laughs> suppose. Um, so this is my outfit for today. One second, you're out of focus. I am you're in focus. wearing... <laughs> La Bourge, hello! I'm wearing um, my Stuart Wiseman over the knee boots, which Piglet loves getting her paw prints on, obviously. And then I have on my wax. Um, Topshop jeans. Have on my Topshop jacket. All Saints like jumper. This scarf is from Jimmy Choo, which I got as a gift from them a couple of weeks That's ago. I love it. I'm wearing the scarf and the boots. Autumn officially. And then I have my Balenciaga bag. There you go. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It just looks like you're wearing a lot of black. I'm wearing a lot of black. It's autumn. Winter is coming. I can wear black. Yes. Once in my life, I'm on time, leaving for the train station. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> And there's Taylor. I'm here early for once in my whole life and I have a coffee and have a banana. Sorted. <laughs> Such a loser. I made it to London and uh, I'm not gonna lie, I almost just totally stacked it in the street. A little bit embarrassing. On the plus side, I found Hannah and she caught me, so it's all good. She didn't let me uh, stack it in front of all the commuters. That would have been so embarrassing if you weren't there. Honestly, oh my God. You know when you go over on, on your heel and because I'm wearing these stupid boots, it's not good. We also decided to come out wearing matching outfits as per usual. We're like Tweedledum and Tweedledee. And- I literally nearly put that top on. <laughs> We have exactly the same top as well. Um, so today we're actually off for a meeting together, which is exciting because it does not happen very often. But I don't know if you guys remember, when I got married, I started a channel called Bride Force all about weddings and my wedding. And Hannah was on it too, because she is, or was a wedding planner before she had the babies. And um, we're thinking about relaunching it because we get so many comments from you guys saying how useful the videos are and how you wish there was more content and we don't really post on it anymore. So what we're doing is going for a meeting today about potentially relaunching the bridal channel. What do you guys think? I don't know. It will happen very soon, but we're really excited about it because it's something to do together. I feel like we used to spend so much time together and it was like something really cool that we used to do together and now we don't see each other as much because we live further apart. And I get to come to London. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so yeah, we're really excited about it and I'll keep you guys updated. We have basically like a massive creative meeting similar to yesterday. I've got like, it's probably gonna be about four hours. We're hoping, Hannah's gotta leave at three o'clock. We're hoping we might have an hour of shopping afterwards. Yeah. I'm hoping anyway. So that's what's happening today. It's another beautiful day in London today. Blue skies. I'm just loving this autumn weather. I'm getting way overexcited. Every time the seasons change, I'm like, yes, get my old wardrobe out. I'm excited about getting boots. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I'm boots. wearing. We're both wearing I'm boots so today. So excited about boots. Right now. <laughs> so many boots. The meeting went really well. Um, we've got some really exciting stuff coming up for you guys. We're now in press, having a little bit of lunch, and this always reminds me of you because you're super weird. But Hannah always has soup and popcorn in press. Do you put the popcorn in the soup? Look. And then it goes a little bit soggy, but then you have to eat it really quickly. Such a weirdo. I've got um, the chicken and broccoli soup, which I'm tr gonna try not to spill all over myself. Chicken and broccoli soup, and then I also got the crayfish oh, salad. I might try it with the popcorn. Look at it all shriveling up. I'm not sure about this, Hen. It's delicious. It's gonna be really soggy. Yours has gone a little bit too soggy. <laughs> I like popcorn, but that is definitely too soggy. Good. It's good, but... Wait, try it just before it goes soggy. Mm -hmm. Ready? Both. Mm -hmm. Tasty? <laughs> when you get a bit of crunchy, you better soggy. No. I mean, I think I'd rather eat it after. I may have sneakily snuck into Topshop, and I'm trying on a few things. Naughty. Look how amazing this is. Look at the back. They only had a size 12 or a size 6, so we shall see. Oh my god guys, I'm beyond excited right now. So I'm back at the flat now and I'm working on a blog post all about boots. 
So, I have been obsessed with these boots that a lot of people have right now. I'm just going to Google them. Um, they're from Givenchy and the buckle boots. I'm pretty sure you guys might have seen them because a lot of celebrities have them. Or quite a lot of bloggers have them. But they're like £900. So, these boots, the ones I'm talking about, they're the Givenchy studded multi boots aren't they amazing so i have what well, i had noticed that top shop my friend lucy actually spotted this um i noticed that top shop made really similar boots called the amy boots which look like this so a really similar copy but they are sold out everywhere so basically this whole kind of like process of searching for these boots they're on ebay for like 150 quid but i'm not going to pay that I was like, you know what, I'm going to do a um, spend or splurge versus save post about autumn boots on my blog. So I've been researching autumn boots and then I was just looking on River Island and I found these bad boys for £80. But they're having, like, they're currently having a, um, like, spend and save event on the River Island website. So I got them for £65. They're real leather. And look how close they are to the Givenchy ones. Not those ones. So these are the Givenchy ones. These are the River Island ones. Okay, very naughty, but I'm not going to lie. It's saving me quite a lot of money and I'm really excited about this. So I've just ordered those. Um, I will also put a link if you guys want to find them to my blog post because I'm finishing that off now. So by the time this video goes up, it's going to be live, which I'm excited about. Um, you know when you get that real buzz of finding like a real something you really want, but it's a bargain. Like I was considering buying the full price ones. I was like, I can't spend that much money. They're so expensive. And then I found those. And I think I even prefer them because they're a bit less studded. So they're a bit less kind of like over the top. And I definitely prefer them to the Topshop ones because they are like more similar to the Givenchy ones. So very exciting moment, guys. I'm such a shopping loser. So my dinner has arrived. I was really good and went for the seafood salads. And Rima is here looking very smug because I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> that pizza looks amazing. I finally made my post live about my favorite winter boots. Yay, it only took me a while. But here it is. I hope you guys like it. Go and check it out. It's floodforce.com if you want to read it. Which I would obviously recommend. <laughs> so it is goodness knows how late now. Um, I just actually fell asleep and I woke up. I was like, I need to finish my vlog. Um, I had such a good evening with Rima. It was so nice to see her. And just, yeah, have a good chin wag. And I've had a really nice day, actually. Um, I hope you guys are all doing well. I'm sorry as well about having, like double vlogtober vlogs like two days in one just the way everything's fallen so far um i've been doing that but they're not all going to be like that so yeah i hope you don't mind it's just a little bit of a different way to doing it to normal um on busy days and i don't end up vlogging so much so um yeah i'll be doing some kind of single ones some double ones hope you don't mind and yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs>